Hey folks, this is Deco here, and welcome back to the Moony Madness of RimWorld. So at the end of last episode, we had a mysterious sinkhole appear over here. I'm sorry, a strange sinkhole. A massive tunnel that burrows deep beneath the earth. So, you have a couple options here. You can ignore it. It causes sanity loss within this big of an area. On a map that has a bunch of animals, this is actually really funny because you'll be doing your own thing and you look over and there's like some crazed muffalo trying to kill all his family. That's pretty funny. You can also sacrifice a prisoner, or you can try to fill it up. Uh, that doesn't go well. Angry things come out. So we don't have a prisoner, so we're going to wait until our next group of proto-prisoners comes along. And then we're going to see if one of them wants to visit the underground, because funny things happen. And if you haven't seen that yet, you're going to like it. It's pretty great. So, we had just finished up gun turrets, so we're going to go ahead and we're going to build some turrets. I'm actually going to take apart this area right here, and here's why. Um, I think that... Usually you can get away with this, but because we don't have a second set of doors, I think that pathing through all that way is, like, too far. And I think that that's why things have decided to attack us outdoors instead of walking through our traps. So, we're going to take those apart so they path the correct direction. And... Let's clear the home zone there, too, so they don't, I don't know, do that constantly. Alright, we are researching our cult. We need to get some walls built up shortly. We've decided not to starve to death, which is cool. Hauling some silver, yep, that's nice. Yeah, yeah, very good. You just haul right away. You know what, actually? Is there any reason that I would not roof in our entire kill box right now? There's nothing to catch on fire. It'll make things easier for our vampire. It will keep some snow off things, although that's kind of a moot point at this issue, at this point right here. You know what, let's just do that. It'll be funny. I can't think of any good reason not to, so... Aww. Uh. Where are you going? Oh, hauling. Right. Okay, and let's get a couple of guns built. Ooh, the strange symbols. Yes. Okay, hold on just a few seconds here. We'll move on with that momentarily here. We have some more... Granite? Yes, we have some granite. Let's make a couple of granite embrasures here really quick. Oh yeah, these cool things. You'll like those. They're fun. Except they use wood, but... Actually, that's going to be a huge problem, isn't it? Hmm. Okay, well, we'll deal with that as it comes. I'm going to replace one of these right there, and have less to do that, and then make a gun. Even if it's just a gun to start out with. A gun is better than no gun. Can you... Okay, well, I see... Okay, thank you. I was just going to say. So we'll get that taken care of. This place is filthy. Soda... Why don't you clean as a priority right at this exact moment in time? Because it's really gross in here. There's puke everywhere. Yeah. Alright. Because I'm actually going to put a gun behind here. I don't usually do that, but like, we are having some problems here with people dying in my base. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to start this as soon as people stop walking through his construction areas. Soda. Just sand. Oh, for the sake, for the sake of Pete. Relaxing socially. How about you build us a turret instead? We need more power. We need more power, like, now. These aren't blocked by anything, right? Oh, no, it is blocked by the sarcophagus. Okay, well, I don't know where that is. Like, where that corpse went anyway, so... No, 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 don't do that. In fact, hold on. Hmm, um, what can we flip off in the meantime, quick? I guess we can flip off our stove. That'll help just a little bit. Didn't I mute you? Doesn't seem to help. Well, whatever. Yeah, 80 watts. Not super helpful. Okay, so now we need to get our cult going properly. So we're going to need to... Let's learn how to make an altar first, so that as soon as we find a deity, we're all set. Yep, that'll be fine. Trade caravan is leaving, very good. Alright, so what's he gonna do next, once he's done cutting some stone blocks? Oh, that's right, we've got all that steel we need to do with. Yeah. Should I put some walls up inside here? We do need them. You know what? Let's do that. Yep, let's do that. 
Zone, area, stockpile, extend stockpile. Yes, yes, yes. Need warm clothes, tattered apparel, blah, blah, blah. We know. Yeah, food poisoning, I know. So let's see here. This needs to be here. And uh, here. Can't put it everywhere I want it. And here, and here, and here. Okay. That'll give us actually extra bedrooms, so that's all well and good. What are you doing? Watching the sunset. Uh, 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 Alright, fine. You do that. Stupid wind? What is... Oh, it's just our heaters using all this power. Right. As Lester researches, he feels his sanity begin to slip. That's good for you. Okay, we've got six meals. Let's keep an eye on that. I know, need warm clothes, blah, blah, blah. Ooh. I didn't think of a cult name. Um. Duh, I, I don't know. Um. Sorry, that's the funniest I can hope with on the spot, and it's not funny. Alright. So now, oh, we can rename it. Oh, thank God. Or whatever. This is actually kind of annoying. Hmm. Well, whatever. You get what you get. Okay, so we've got a bunch of hauling to do here. Yes, it feels like someone is watching him. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes, okay. Right. Oh, he didn't get the debuff, besides the sanity loss. Oh, okay. Well, that's not bad. Okay, well, in that case, why don't you go ahead and let's start finding some deities, and let's see who we find. This could be very interesting. Okay, now that our power is coming back up. Now do you have the paranoia thing? Anxious? Just anxious. Okay, that's fine. Just a ton of hauling to do for poor Soda. Moving all this crap back and forth. And there is rather a lot of it. If it wasn't so cold, I'd just pop a hole in the wall right here, but... That would not be a great plan. So we won't do that. Gained another level in vampirism. Cool. Someone is watching him. Yes, someone is watching you. I didn't realize you got a mood buff for the full moons. That's pretty cool. Alright, and let's get these beds moved someplace normal. Now this should actually be assigned to Lester. Oh, this is art. A personified depiction of desolation. Yes. Oh, I can't assign these as a bed. I thought that you could. Maybe I was not paying attention the last time I was playing. Because I thought that you could. Never mind. Well, that's fine. You know what? He can have a coffin in his room anyway. Doesn't that kind of seem like the thing that you would want to do if you were a vampire? Is have like a back of coffin? We will have to move it. Put it right there. Oh, I should run some power over so I can turn our turret on when I need to. Haha, <laughs> wouldn't that have been funny? The answer is no, by the way. That would not have been funny. Not even a little. Yeah, I know, they're getting food poisoning from all these meals. And that's my fault. Okay, who did we get? Ooh. Okay. Let's keep going, though. Let's see who else we can find. Yeah, let's see who else we can find. Sagthua? I'm not sure how to say that. Interesting. Okay, good. Yeah, see, we're gonna be fine now, like... Food-wise. Yes, probe the occult deities. So we have worshipped Cthulhu, and we have worshipped Hathor in previous games. Crows? Uh-oh. That's not good. Um... Can I build another gun? 175 steel. Okay, um, let's get this stuff hauled urgently. Let's get this stuff inside right away. Crap. Lester, that means you too. Okay, you're also set to do that. Go ahead. Everyone go, 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 go. Don't, Stargaze. Haul urgently. What part of haul urgently do you not understand? Crows are bad. 
Ah, that's funny. A crow with hypothermia. It is pretty cold outside. We do need to get some leather. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, an escape pod. Really? John, huh? You're a crappy colonist. Incapable of violent, intellectual, or artistic. You can't grow. You can't cook. You're an idiot. Jealous and lazy. You know what? Oh, I have a plan. <laughs> yeah, you know where this is going. You know where this is going. Yes. A wanderer joins. Okay. Vivian, please be useful. First of all, what are you wearing? Muffalo cultist robes. Nice. I assume that that means that they're made of muffalo skin, not that you worship mufflos. That's not the point right now. Oh my god. Abrasive, no dumb labor, caring, intellectual, artistic, or cooking. What can you do? You can craft and you can chat. All right. All right. What is it about a scary cult that makes people think, geez, I'm terrified of violence, so I'm just not going to do anything about it, and we're just going to go join this group of crazy people. Okay, anyway, never mind. Wait, so you can hunt? Ugh, whatever. Stop thinking about it. Smithing, actually, you're pretty good at these. Not awesome, but... Alright. Alright, we've even got a bedroom for you, I think. Well, ish. We've got a bedroom-ish. Which these vents cost? 30 steel. That's kind of a lot of steel. But, okay. And then, what can we use inside? We can just use limestone doors. As such. And we'll get those turned into proper bedrooms. Alright. And Hunter lacks ranged weapon. Oh yeah, what do we have for a good weapon for you? We really don't. Why don't you come actually take the hunting rifle? They pack a punch. Although you do need good, um, good aim to make it useful for anything. Non-violent, non-hauling. Gosh. Annoying. Alright. Let's get Lester on in here. With our new friend, let's say. Yes. It'd be easy to recruit him, but I'm not gonna, because I don't care. So, um, Soda, why don't you come doctor? That's okay, uh, go ahead and take care of that steel first. He'll survive for a few minutes, right? Oh, maybe he won't, actually. <laughs> um, how about you come tend to him right away? Hypothermia. It's not that cold in here. You've been cold, though, so yeah. There you go. You'll be fine. Okay, so is that all the crows we're going to do to give us trouble? I think that may be the case, and that would be okay. Alright, so in that case, what we're going to do is... I think I'd like to clean this area out super quick and get this stuff built, and then we will put John to good use. Yep. Okay, who do we get now? Cthulhu. Alright, um, keep going. I think I was thinking of, like, Yag sothoth or something. Okay. And tribes people. I didn't need this many sacrifices, but thank you. I find that extremely considerate. Alright, everyone in the home area. Oh yeah, I was going to build another gun, wasn't I? Hmm. I wonder if I can build it in time. This will be interesting to find out. I don't think so, but maybe. Okay, well, the rest of you go ahead and take your defensive positions. The two of you that have defensive positions. Oh, yeah. I gotta close this. Come here, you. Now I am getting a little tired of that whispering. wonder if he is gonna get that gun done. Looks like he might. Well, I guess we'll find out. And we better turn this one on, too. This should be fine. Attacking walls, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wind turbines. Attacking granite wall. Attacking solar generator. 
This kind of sucks because this means that we're going to get crappy weapons from them, but that's okay. Alright, let's do it. Let's see what we get. One down. So far so good. Focus your fire. Focus your fire. There we go. We're not going to get any prisoners out of this, are we? Not looking like it. Come on. Don't ah, nope. No prisoners. Alright. Well, the important part is we tried. Alright, well that was pretty straightforward. So you know, I'm really glad that I went and got that guy. Because otherwise, this would have been a huge pain. Okay, not a huge pain, but it would have been a pain, that's for sure. Okay. Fine. Okay, getting our stocks replanted. And did you get these buildings done up here? You did not. Why don't you come build these? Just so that everyone's going to have a bedroom. Because we are going to start getting debuffs from that. And I don't want to deal with it. And John, we don't want to feed him. So just hold on a few minutes. We'll have this for him momentarily. This needs to be hauled. Okay. And please do this. Thank you. And do this. Thank you. Okay. So as I said, you probably know exactly where this is going. <gasps> Ibexi! Wow, that is a lot of them. Uh, uh, if they go wrong, I can't kill that many Ibexes. So, um, I, I guess we'll just not worry about them. Oh yeah, should we bother stripping any of these guys? Um, yeah... Maybe cultist robes. Yeah, we might as well. Okay. So anyway, now that it's 18 o'clock, you know exactly where this is going. Bye bye John. It was nice knowing you. Not. People still say that, right? I'm pretty confident they do. It's really, like, convenient that he fell from the sky, and now he's going to fall under the ground. Come on, sacrifice faster. How hard can this be? Toss him in there. There! Now, we could fill it in safely, but we're not gonna. Trust me, it's totally worth it. He feels greatly distressed, really. Paranoid. Yep. Don't worry about it. It's going to get worse before it gets better. Wait, shouldn't you be cooking? Oh no, did I change your priorities? Where are you? Lester. Yup, I did. Whoops. So everyone's been eating rice, like raw rice probably. This is really inconvenient, having my primary cook also be my researcher. Hmm. Well, oh well. You get what you get. Actually, he's pretty quick at this, so maybe that won't matter. Okay, this is fine. Let's build some more graves. How many do we need? Four, five, six. Sure. Err. Four, five. Oh, for the love of all that's holy. Hold on here. We can't look like this. If you don't have an organized graveyard, then what do you have? A mess, that's what. That didn't really go anywhere. All right. We still need the proper cult. Okay, who do we get? Hastor. Ugh. Like, Hastor's fine, but... Oh, we need some more slate. Where's some more slate? We're gonna make all of our cult stuff out of slate, because it's cool. And black. Oh, this is all slate, right? Yeah, okay. Let's haul that in. Tattered apparel, I know. Actually, our new person is not too bad at tailoring. So, I tell you what. Let's go ahead and let's go make some dusters. We can make four of them. That'll be fine. They'll get used for something eventually. And that's Vivian, right? Yeah. Here, can you guys just, like, haul this stuff out there? Like, seriously. Just move it. It's not that hard. 
All urgently. Oh yeah, I've got like knives and stuff. All right. Is that it? That's it. That's it. All right, now we're done. Okay, so. Still need a proper god, but we're getting closer. What are you doing? Oh, observing art. Yes. How wonderful is the art. Yeah, we're gonna stay ahead on food. Oh yeah, oops. We're gonna stay ahead on food, but... Wait. There we go. Yes, he feels greatly distressed. We're gonna stay ahead on food, but having these two combined, like the cook and research, is gonna slow us down. I'm not super happy about that, but... Alright. Low food again. Yeah, I know. We're working on it. Look at him cooking away. We got tons of meals. Everything's fine. Our sacrifice has returned. Oddly intact. Yes. Isn't he? Isn't he just? Taking a wounded prisoner. Okay. Is he going to survive long enough? Probably. He's got a bite on his leg. That's mysterious, isn't it? Dagon, yeah. Okay. I kind of had my heart set on Shubnigaroth, although it doesn't really matter. Disease. Strange worms. That's odd. What could a strange worm be? Very mysterious. Let's take a look at his health. Strange worms, initial. Um, yeah, we'll be able to keep him alive. Why don't you go ahead and why don't you tend to him? Yeah. Pain times 130, consciousness, hearing, moving, manipulation. Oh, you know what else we should make is a straight jacket. For the ones that we're not just gonna, like, pull their limbs off quick. Yeah, we should do that. Narlathotep, K. Okay. Yeah, you know what? Do we have enough leather to make all these things that I want to make? Actually, we kind of don't. Listers begin uttering unnatural sounds instead of speech. Are you going crazy? Like, oh, okay, um, haha. <laughs> Let's switch our research to something else for a little bit so that you calm down a little bit. Right. How about... ARs. Right? Or that's precision rifling, right? Yeah. Why don't you go work on guns for a little bit? Won't that be nice? Yes, it will. How crazy are you right now? Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. I mean, I don't mind a little bit of crazy. That's fine. Yeah, I'm not confident that we have the materials to make all the stuff that I want to make. So I think we may have to hold off for a little bit on the uh, straight jacket and just hope that he doesn't do anything stupid. Because we need these dusters and stuff first. And she's okay at this, but not great. Crafting a 7. Well, if I can get her up to 10, then she'll be a useful member of our team. So that we can make components at some point in the near future. And that would be nice. Yeah, we're doing great on food now. As we have 7 meals and almost nothing left to cook. But that's not the point. The point is we're doing great on food. Okay, so... Once again, we're low on steel. Now, I do remember that silver meteorite. Don't worry about it. Don't you worry. Hmm. Oh, this is inactive. I should go fill it. That would be important. So he'll go take care of that. So some steel over here. There's some steel up here. I guess, I guess we can go do that. That's fine. Oh, someone died up here. Oh, superior longsword. Huh. Alright, let's make sure nothing comes out to attack Gallagher. If it does, I will feel extremely bad. You can hear human cries from below as he shovels into the pit. Yeah, they do that. John can walk again. And goodbye, humans. More silver. Jeez, maybe we can just buy our raw materials. That'd be nice. What are you wearing that's tattered? Oh, several things. 
Okay, well... We'll deal with that later. Okay, there's a nice duster. Why is no one wearing it? What's the heat? Oh, it's only 15? Oh, because it's leather. Right. So that's actually not going to be hardly any better than the stuff they have. This is minus 33. Yeah, and this is minus 15. So, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's not make that. Let's go ahead and let's make a straight jacket. That'll be fine. Where are they lurking in here? Straight jacket. Make that out of leather. Thank you very much. Just in case John goes crazier than he already is. I'm just saying. That could be a problem. It's potentially a problem. Lester, how are you doing, buddy? Found the cult. You know what? Let's go ahead and let's set up our little chapel here. Just because I want everyone to get all cult-minded. I don't really care who we start worshipping because it's not going to matter right away. Wait, what? We don't have enough slate? Oh, no, we don't. Hmm. Alright, that's fine. We'll get it made anyway. Oh, yeah, because no one's done this yet. Yeah. John has been bitten to death. Oh, and I missed it off to the side. Look, we've got a larva. <gasps> Aren't these amazing? They're the best. Larva are super cool. Powerful burrowers, which can live for more than a thousand years, and they're protective of their young, said that a chanting sound accompanies Erichthonian, and that by such they can be detected while underground and unseen. Yes. These are super cool, but on the other hand, I don't think I can train it. Well, I can try. Nine's not bad. Let's just see if you can train it to haul. If it eats too much, then, well, whatever. Actually, you know what we should do is leave corpses out for it. In fact... Um... Let's deconstruct it. And then our animal needs to go into a new area. Uh, let's call this new animal corpses. And... What we'll do is we'll just keep him out of the fridge until he has finished eating the body. And actually, we can just keep digging bodies up for him. And that will be super convenient. Won't it just... Corpses, invert. Thank you very much. Wait. Where are they putting corpses that I'm not seeing them? Because corpses should not be allowed anywhere else. Right? No human corpses. No human corpses. Where did he go? Well, anyway, let's take a few of these part. Oh, he's right there, obviously. That's fine. Gained another level in vampirism. Very good. Okay. Gallagher's begin plotting against a local cult. Great. Uh, now we're going to have to keep track of him. All right. Oh, you know what? We don't need this either at the moment. So let's just go ahead and let's just pause this. And turn this off. And Vivian, why don't you come cut some blocks? Hey! What are you doing in there? Oh, corpses. Right. Eating my damn meals is what you're doing. Alright, we're going to have to keep an eye on Gallagher. Because he's going to be a problem now. Crap. I was going to say, I knew I needed to keep our cult-mindedness up a little higher. That's my fault. Well, obviously it's my fault. I can actually rename them. But we'll see if he manages to get any training done first. Let's give it a spot to sleep, too, so it stays in, like, a particular place. Why don't you sleep next to our research table? Because that is exactly how these things work. Chunk of a spacecraft. Oh, super convenient. Like, right here. Alright. Excellent. Hey, where's Gallagher? He's up here mining, right? Well, he's doing whatever. Okay, let's see if he can train. Oh, that's right, you're gonna waste our rice. 15%? Ugh. You know what? I can't afford that at the moment. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna turn your training off. But that's okay, you can still just wander around. As long as there's bodies around, you'll be fine. Birthday? That's right, he's immortal. 
Nice. Very nice. We're gonna have to make a little place to put these corpses. Because we don't need these continuous mood debuffs. Yeah. Um, we've got a little bit of limestone. So I tell you what. Let's just go ahead and let's just make a little area right here. It can be that big. Right? With a limestone door. And then... We'll just put a little place inside. And that is where we will keep our bodies. Okay, settings. And actually, we're going to set this to normal priority, because I'd rather have them in there. So if you could haul these, please. And then that will give our larva something to eat. So he's not eating us out of house and home, if you will. Out of rice and home. Alright, Lester, are you sane again yet? Yes, you actually are. Why don't you take a moment and come construct this altar so that I can start getting our worship going. Because we're going to need to keep track of Gallagher. I need to get him cult-minded again is what I need. Yeah, he's not that far down. Innocent prisoner died. Well, it's not really my fault. He got brain worms. I mean, I tried. Yeah, see? Eating corpses. Yes. Very good. Dude, why is this taking so long? Oh. This requires quite a bit of work, doesn't it? Alright, that's fine. Come on. Chop, chop. Tempus Fugit. Time flies like an arrow. Fruit flies like a banana. It's funny, it's okay. Holy crap, this takes a lot of work. I'm gonna let him finish it anyway. And... Ta-da! Okay, so... A masterwork. Nice. Very nice. Okay, let's just pick somebody at random. We'll start with Nyarlathotep, and that's fine. And we'll do morning sermons. Yes, we'll do morning sermons. Okay, can we build some benches? It'd be nice if we could. Mmm, kinda. We could build them on a slate once we have a little more slate. Yeah, let's do that. That'll work. Let's get some more slate inside. Yep, this'll be fine. Look at all this food we have. What are we even gonna do with all this food? It's amazing. Mental break, food binge. Alright. That's fine. I mean, it's not fine, but... Alright. Gallagher, what are you doing? Harvesting rice. Yeah, can you just finish this up, please? And then it's done. Thank you. Okay. Right. Well, I guess I could do evening sermons as well. Yeah, that's fine. Like I said, I just need to get him back into the fold. I don't trust him. I don't trust him at all. He's just not a trustworthy sort. We should stop eating all of our food. Come on, stop eating my food. Gathers for a sermon, but Gallagher is way the hay up here. So he's not even going to get there in time. No, he's not. Hmm. Oh, this still counts as witnessing an ominous sermon. Oh, look, he's back over the minor tick. All right. Good. Very good. I'm going to turn this off evenings then. Okay, Lester, are you sane again? I think you are. The stars are wrong. Unbound to the proper order of the cosmos, the stars themselves seem to sting our eyes with a hateful scorn. Well, that's not good. I don't know what that means. That's concerning. I find that very concerning. Okay. Is that like giving you a mood debuff? Hmm. Alright. Well, let's go back and let's find another deity, please. Oh, and this is starting to run a little long. So let's go ahead and let's take a break. So when we come back, we'll continue to work on our religion. But as always, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.